All right, y'all, so when starting off with the box, we have this translucent sleeve that has Cactus Jack, Nike Air, Air Jordan, and Fragment logos all over it. And this is one of my favorite details of the box. And once we take off the sleeve now, we have our standard Air Jordan box with the military blue and cream colorway, as you guys can see here. Now, let me show you guys a sticker real quick. And on the sticker, it shows Air Jordan 1 Low OGSP, and the colorway shown is Sail and Military Blue Black. So my true to size is a size 8, so that's what this was topped in, and the suggested retail is $150. However, your boy missed out on the sneakers app and on all the raffles, so the girl that's recording the video is the one who actually copped this for resale for my birthday. So I appreciate you, A Boogie. I love you so much, and thank you. But now when we take off the lid, we're getting into our star of the show. But before we get into that, we have this beautiful pink wax tissue paper that has the same symbols just like on the translucent sleeve. So we have our Nike Air branding, Cactus Jack branding, Fragment branding, and Air Jordan bragging all over. So next, once we take this off, we have some more, the white tissue paper, and then we have these babies right here, y'all. These joints are so freaking crazy, y'all. So to briefly go over the history of the shoe, it's a collaboration between Air Jordan brand, Travis Scott, and Hiroshi Fujiyara's brand Fragment Design. And as you guys can see by the detail on the back heel, this is a Fragment Design logo. And then when we go into the medial side, you can see the style code with Travis Scott's name as well as Hiroshi Fujiyara's name right there. So that basically concludes the history of the shoe. And now getting into the details, let's start off on the lateral side. And of course with the Travis Scott Jordans, we always get this beautiful reverse swoosh right here. But what I really like about it is that the outline of the leather swoosh actually has this kind of peach fuzz on it which makes it pop a lot. Next, when we go on to the toe box of the shoe, we have an OG Air Jordan toe box right here with our perforated holes in this kind of cream colorway. Then we have the black toe surrounding the mud guard right there. So now moving on to the tongue, we have this kind of cream or peach colorway on the tongue. Then when we move up onto it, we have this Cactus Jack branding right there, as well as a Nike Air tab in this military blue colorway, which I really love. Next, going on to the medial side of the shoe, we have a different type of hit to the shoe. So instead of the reverse swoosh on the medial side, we actually get our standard Nike check right there in a black colorway. And on the quarter panel, we have that white leather as well, which is a really nice touch. Then when looking deeper into the quarter panel, you could actually see that there's a Cactus Jack logo right here, which I don't know if it's going to be 3M on this shoe, but I know on the OG shoe it was 3M. So I haven't tried that out yet, but I'll let y'all know in the comment section down below. Then when we go on to the heel of this shoe specifically, we have an embroidered Air Jordan logo right there with a white colorway surrounding it. And then as I mentioned before, we have our Fragment Design logo. Next, when we go into the insole of the shoe, we have a military blue insole as well as a black Nike Air logo right there, as you guys can see. And then when going on to the midsole, you guys can see we have an aged midsole with a blue outsole right here with our regular herringbone traction, which I really love for the Air Jordan ones. And then we have our Nike Air logo right there. Next, when going on to the left shoe, the same thing pretty much follows suit, but there's actually some little details that makes it different from the right shoe. And we take it out now. The one thing you guys are going to notice is that we actually get extra laces. So the laces that come with the shoe is actually this waxed cream lace, but we also get an extra military blue wax lace, black wax laces, and of course with every Travis Scott, pink wax laces. But another difference to note is that when you actually look at the tongue of the shoe, we actually get the Fragment Design logo on this side of the shoe. Then when we look onto the heel tab, we have another difference right here. So we actually get an embroidered white Cactus Jack logo, as well as a Cactus Jack smiley face or sad face. I really don't know which face it is, but I just love that detail about it. Other than that, child, that's going to conclude the overall history and details of the shoe. So let's get into this awful look, all right? I love you, I love you, I love you, until I, until I, I love you, I love you, I love you. Out, so that's gonna conclude the overall review as well as the awful look and other than that be sure to like share comment and subscribe be sure to share with your friends and your family make sure to smash that like button if you see anything that you like throughout the video or if you're new to my channel be sure to subscribe down below and hit that notification bell and other than that i'll catch you on the next one peace